Good morning guys, welcome to another Lucy vlog. Today you join me again for another workout. I put some stuff out on my Instagram, I'm asking for exactly what you guys want and I hope today what I've created is something that you can do and join in with me. And quick disclaimer, I am by no means a workout specialist, personal trainer, anything like that. This is just a workout I've made myself that I really enjoy doing and I've been watching a lot of workouts on YouTube recently, so quick disclaimer, I'm not a professional in this, but feel free to join in. It's like legs, uh, butt and abs kind of combined. It'll be about 15 to 20 minutes and we've got quite a few exercises to get through. Thanks for clicking on the video. I've got a little timer here this time so you guys can actually see with me the exact time and then how long we've got left. So we'll do 45 seconds of the exercise and a 15 minute, uh, 15, I did the same last time a 15 second break. But I'm super excited for this one. All you need is, if you have it, a water bottle to do some weighted stuff with. If you don't have that, you can still do the exercises just without that. This is just a slightly harder version of it. But I'm super excited for this one. Let's get started. Okay, we're gonna do a little warm up to start with, because that's always important. Just a little stretch on the legs, as that's one of the main things we'll be working out today. And then just forwards and touch the floor if you can. If not, just get as far as the floor as you can, and you'll feel that stretch. Cool. And do this one. Try and hold that balance. On the other side. Cool. And then just some circular motions going backwards first. Just making little circles with your arms. And then forwards. Nice. Okay, let's do it. Okay, I've not used this before. Let's just bear with me. Let's see how it is. Seven, six, cool. five, okay. four, three, two, one. We're starting Start. with a squat. 15 minutes to go. So remember not to let your uh, knees go past your feet if you can and kind of um, act like you're sitting down onto something so it's quite far back. And squeeze at the top. I actually did this workout yesterday uh, and I'm feeling it today, so definitely works. <laughs> okay, 15 seconds. Five, four, three, two, and one. Cool, 15 second break. And then we're gonna move on to some leg extensions on the floor. Um, I'm doing it this way to film it, so I'm a little bit squished here. So I'm gonna have to put my head underneath this TV unit, but maybe you guys have a bit more room. So we're gonna push one leg out at a time. So on your hands and knees, and you're just pushing that one leg up. And we're just gonna do one leg for the whole time. And then for the next set of 45 seconds, we'll move on to the other leg. I'm actually going to do it facing forward so I can properly do the exercise, but do it wherever you guys are most comfortable. Keep breathing, keep smiling. Make it nice and controlled. 10 seconds. second break and then we're going to move on to the other leg. For me it's my right leg. I just do whichever one you didn't do last time. Grab some water if you need to. Okay, let's go. 30 minutes to go. Okay, 15 seconds. 
three, two, and one. Take a breather, grab some water before we move on to, uh, this is a good one for the abs. So this is where they're grabbing our water bottle. Um, if you haven't got this, maybe you've got something heavy with a handle you can use, and we're just gonna hold it in one side and pull like this. You should really feel it in your abs just here. And you're keeping your body flat like that. And you're literally just pulling with your core muscles to the side. We're gonna do this for the whole time again on one side. And then the next lot of 45 seconds, we'll move on to the other side. seconds to go. This one's really good for your sides as well. Just a quick add in there. And take a breather, pop your object, whatever it is, down. Um, without the object, you can still do the movement. So if you haven't got anything, you're still gonna be doing something without holding onto a water bottle or whatever. Okay, let's change to the other side. 11 minutes to go. Pulling up. Really engage your core when you're doing this. into the little leg scissor things on the floor. Um, again, I'm gonna have to tuck myself underneath the TV unit for this one, so you guys can see. 10 minutes to go. So we're on one side, and we're just lifting your leg up as high as you can. Nice steady motion. Don't actually let your leg drop and touch your other foot yet. Just keep it in the air, just kind of hover it, and then go straight back up again, just like that. And we're gonna do this for 45 seconds, and then move on to the other leg. And time. Have a breather. Let me know in the comments what workout you guys want next as well. Always appreciate the support on these videos. Nine minutes okay. to go. Now we're gonna go for the other leg, so switch sides. Oh my goodness, thank you good. <laughs> to a weighted squat that's with the water bottle. Again, so pick that back up or something else that's heavy. Eight minutes to go. Get creative, let me know what you guys use. We're just gonna hold this here and just do our squat again, but it's gonna be a little bit harder because we've got some more weight on us. So get as low as you can, nice and low, squeeze in at the top. Do it this way so you can see. Very 
doing well so far, guys. Say so we may be halfway there. Awesome. Okay, so the next one we're doing is seven minutes. Holding it sideways. We're gonna squat in a hold position. So just keep it low and just slowly lift the water bottle into the air like this. Nice and controlled. Make it easy. But keep your squat held. I find doing this with your arms actually distract yourself from your legs burning, so it's quite a good one. Follow your whole body and keep your core nice and engaged as well. 15 seconds to go. Oh. Five seconds. Oh. Ah. Cool, nice one. What do we have next? Okay, we're now doing Russian twists. You remember this one from the last workout video I did, the full body 10 minute workout. So let's get back on the floor. Six minutes to go. And we're gonna do the Russian twist like this. You can make it harder by grabbing your water bottle like this, and just tapping it each side. This is a very heavy water bottle, so <laughs> this is making it very, very tricky, but it's good. I'll dip forwards as well so you can see that. It's almost like you're about to tap it on the floor. 15 seconds to go. the last workout as well. This one's very good for your butt and legs. Five minutes to go. So we're just on the floor like this. We're lifting up. Kind of squeezing at the top. Again, if you want to make it more difficult, grab your trusty weight, whatever it may be, pop it here. And then you're doing it weighted. This will stay as like a right angle just here and we'll do this for half the time on each leg. So legs slightly wider, get nice and low. This is kind of like what you'd normally do with a kettlebell, uh, but we're using our water bottle today.
actually doing this without the aircon on today, which is why I'm more out of breath and sweaty than normal. Uh, but I thought we'd be better for the video so you don't hear that kind of annoying in the background. Um, two more exercises to go, both are abs workouts, so let's get back on the floor. And we're gonna do heel touches, so in the glute bridge position again, but we're gonna go and touch each heel one at a time. I'll do it this way so you can see what I mean. Just like that. Reach as far as you can. If you want to make it harder, put your legs further away. Then you've got to stretch even more. 15 seconds. One more to go. Keep going, don't give up. Oh, staying on the floor though, which is nice. Uh, we're gonna do the like leg raises. Um, how can I show you best? I think staying this way. One minute to go. Put your hands underneath your butt. Lift your legs up nice and straight. Lower them, but don't touch the floor. And then bring them back up again. Just like that. Nice controlled movement. Don't hold your breath, keep breathing the whole time. Thirty seconds to go. Awesome, that's fifteen seconds for us. Because we know that last fifteen's a little breather. Nearly there. Five seconds. We did it. Eight, seven, six. Finished already. Five, four, three, two, one. Ta -da! Time's up. Oh, I thought they'd do like some clapping or some celebration. Oh well. Right. Workout's over. Now let's. We're still recording, aren't we? Yes. Now let's do a little warm down. Um, just keep breathing. Do a nice big stretch up. Big inhale of breath and exhale as you let your arms drop. Do that a few times just to slow that heart rate down a little bit. Awesome. And then we're just going to take it across. Just that nice stretch along here for a few seconds. Nicely done, and we'll go to the other side. Ah, oh, all our videos that come up as recommended. <laughs> nice. And then, gonna lean forwards. Feel that stretch in the back of your legs, and then go down and touch the floor. Go to our right leg. Just pull yourself down using your ankle, your toes, as far as you can. You feel that stretch really nicely here. And then walk our way to the other leg. Great job. Okay. A little bend in the knees. Come back up. Oh, great. My nice and sweaty. Now, I don't know about you guys. Okay, now we're gonna do one of my favorites, which you'll remember from the last one, and that is leg across, and go into a little squat just here. Helps with balance if you put your arms forward, I found. Nice, and the other one. Okay, legs are feeling nice and stretched. Arms feeling good. I think we'll call it a day there. So, thank you so much for watching this video. Please give it a big thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Subscribe if you're new and get in the comments for any more workouts you'd like to see in the future. And I'll see you all very soon. Bye guys, stay safe.